LGBTQ plus flash news. The truth about what really goes on at gay days at Disneyland. Next month in September is uh, gay days. The Southern Baptists would have you believe that gay days is a time when we deviants bring all of our deviant behavior to Walt's sacred family destination and try to poison it with our agenda. Instead, what really happens during gay days is that for one weekend of the year, we get to be the majority instead of the minority. We get to walk down Main Street holding the hands of our partners without worrying about the stares we might attract. We get to gather with our families of choice at America's favorite family destination and feel like families feel every single day. Gay Days, September next month. Five words for you. Lazy river sex at Riptide. Yes. <laughs> wow. I've never been to Gay Days, but Audra McDonald and Sheila Rivera are calling my name. Love yeah. that. Also, I, I would just say that Disney has always been really gay. I mean, I, I mean this is a... <laughs> We, we see what we want to see and the things we want, and, and we, yeah. I, ag I mean, I agree with that. I mean, I'm still mad that they're, they're not making Luca an official gay movie, because let's be honest here, it was pretty beautifully romantic and gay as hell. <laughs> uh, gay Days at Disneyland, of course, in Anaheim in Los Angeles, just makes me think about how exciting uh, June of 2022 will be when we get the big, gigantic version of Gay Days in Orlando. LGBTQ plus news is vital for our community and for the broader world as a whole. We have enough enemies at Fox News. Tucker, Sean, and Lara are loud. We need passionate allies. Happening Out Television Network, Queer News Tonight, and It's Happening Out are literally out of the closet and into the headlines. Our community needs your support. Like this broadcast and subscribe now to ensure the growth of the entire LGBTQ plus community.